now we've reached the time of the program that everybody really looks forward to, I think, sometime in some of these awards up here. Some of these young men are uh, going to receive some awards that are, that are well-deserved. And we're going to start by bringing Mr. David Waller up to uh, give out our first award. The first award tonight is the Howard Bridges Scholastic Award. I know a lot of you people out there don't even remember Howard Bridges, but I just want to say one or two words about him. He was my principal back in the 40s. That's a long time ago when most of you we were born. But he, he believed in academics. His, his whole life was dedicated to academics, and we can't say enough about what Mr. Howard Bridges meant to the city of Valdosta and the Valdosta City School System. He served two different times as, as principal and was a wonderful academic principal and believed in the Wildcats. He also has a daughter here tonight, Mary Jane Webber, and a husband Earl. Would y'all can't stand up somewhere? Maybe I'll back here. Thank you. Thank you all for coming. And I would like for Brandon Greenhold to come up, please. And I want to ask you a question too before we get into this thing. Uh, I understand you've got a 4.0 GPA. Is that right? You got a 96 average. Is that right? You never made below an A in high school? <laughs> wow. Wow. Howard Bridges would have loved this young man. Uh, you are the winner of the 19, 2006. Scholarship Award, and this year the Touchdown Club is, is proud to present two $1,000 scholarships. And uh, of course, I, I just can't say enough about this young man. And I will also want Alex Hall to come forward. <laughs> Franklin Bay in the back say a two offensive line. Uh, that, 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 that's, that's special. But I'll read it. Ed, come over here, son. I understand you have a 91. Where are you How about that, folks? <laughs> I'll read this thing. It says, Congratulations, you have been selected to receive the $1,000 Nick Hire. Foundation Scholarship Award for 2006. This scholarship is given in memory of Coach Hyder, who believed it was more important to win in the classroom than on the football field. He would be extremely proud of you because you are an overachiever in the classroom and on the playing field. Only a few are willing to pay the price to do both. But the uh, 2006 Nick Hyder Scholarship Award goes to Alex Hall and Brandon Greenwood.
It's an honor for me tonight to present the Mark Stevens Memorial uh, Sportsmanship Award. Mark Stevens was a fine young man who played with Coach Howard on his first team in 1974. This is what Coach Thompson said of the, this year's award winner. He is one of the finest young men I've had the honor to coach. He represents what fall off the Wildcat should be, class, character, and pride. He is a leader in the classroom and on the field. This year's Sportsmanship Award goes to number 12, Brian Matthews. <laughs> Also, it's an honor for me to present the uh, Dynamite Good Love Memorial Most Improved Award. And uh, Dynamite Good Love played for the Cats in 35, 36, 37. He was a tremendous ball player and also a great golfer and a great fan of Wildcats. Uh, he was also my mother's first cousin. <laughs> <laughs> this is what the coaches said of this year's winner. A very quiet, tough, respectful young man. He do whatever is asked of him. He is also a very talented young man who played several defense and offense positions on the varsity and university. He will be counted on to provide leadership next year. This year's most improved award goes to number 95, Damian Day. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 